Thank you very much. And it's a lot of fun for me doing this one because we're dealing with a very special man, a very special person. Today, it's my pleasure to announce my choice for the next President of the World Bank, Mr. David Malpass. And I've known David for a long time. Very extraordinary man. Thank you very much. Following the resignation of former President of the World Bank, Dr. Jim Young Kim, I launched a broad search for a replacement after interviewing many very qualified candidates. I knew that David was the right person to take this incredibly uh, important job. In addition to his current service overseeing the IMF and actually overseeing the World Bank, as Undersecretary of International Affairs at the Department of the Treasury. David brings 40 years of experience in economics, finance, government, and foreign policy to his new assignment. America is the largest contributor to the World Bank, giving it over $1 billion every year. My administration has made it a top priority to ensure that U.S. taxpayers' dollars are spent effectively and wisely serve American interests, and defend American values. David has been a strong advocate for accountability at the World Bank for a long time. Thank you. So thank you so very much, President Trump. Working with Secretary Mnuchin uh, at Treasury, I'm proud to say that under your administration, Mr. President, we negotiated a major capital increase and reform package for the World Bank. With shareholders and dedicated staff, there's a great opportunity now to implement these constructive reforms that will lead to faster growth and greater prosperity.